A government watchdog group went to court today to ensure lawmakers get paid even if the legislative funding ends. The move is a response to the governor's line item veto in the budget bill, which would defund the legislature come July 1st. Rachel Slavik joins us now live from the Capitol to explain. Rachel. Kim and Allie, this is a petition filed today in court. The more than 100 pages of this lawsuit outline a constitutional amendment which one gr watchdog group believes requires that lawmakers get paid. Now, Eric Cardall is an attorney for the group Association for Government Accountability. He says any attempt to stop payment of the legislature would violate the constitutional amendment that set up a group called the Legislative Salary Council. That council sets lawmaker pay at $45,000 a year, and Cardall argues it also ensures that those payments get made. This filing is not associated with a potential lawsuit by the legislation fo legislature following the governor's line item veto last week. It is only a court filing to make sure that lawmakers get their salary. In this sort of unusual circumstance where you have defunded the state legislative pay in the context of a constitutional amendment guaranteeing that pay it is, is just extraordinary. It's an extraordinary breach of the trust with the public. It's an extraordinary breach of the Constitution and these statutes. Now, we did reach out to the governor's office and have not heard back. And keep in mind, this lawsuit does not pay for any staffing or any other function to keep the House and Senate open. It is solely for lawmaker pay. All right, Rachel, thank you.